Hello, I'm Romina and this is my self-evaluation for the gaming and transmedia storytelling class. So when I first started this class, I thought I knew a little bit about what transmedia is, thanks to like my classmates that had already seen this class. But once the class started, like <clears throat> I mean, it was that what they told me, but it was like even more. Like, I really, really enjoy this class. Like, I have zero experience with transmedia. I mean, I knew, well, transmedia and crossmedia, I actually knew about crossmedia, but didn't know that was the name. <laughs> but once we started with like that week talking about it, I was pretty impressed of all the different kinds of cross-media and trans-media and how to use it and all that stuff and also with the gaming I'm usually very like not very receptive of games and video games and I just don't like them <laughs> but I mean all the things that some companies do with their video games and how they like expand not only like focusing on video games but also like movies and how they use like other sources of like social media as well and other uh, media platforms to like create this whole yeah it's like a different war in our world of normalcy and that's pretty cool I just start working on the second week project I realized I wanted to know more about I don't know <laughs> maybe spend more time on it but I think that the resources our instructor gave us and like the lectures were very helpful like they gave me enough information for me to dig in and start working on the project so I mean I still like did some research on my sites but I feel like I had enough resources to create this whole project. Um, if I had more time, I would have created more video assets, like the visual assets. I would have created in more in like, even like for all the characters, not just focusing on like uh, the Little Red Riding Hood. I mean, I love the idea of her being a teenager and like creating these blogs, well, video blogs. And, but I have zero time. I mean, is that that week I was also working on the video for the portfolio class? But if I had more time, I would have worked on more videos about her. Maybe like videos from like the wolf perspective as well and since like part of Little Red's story includes like her friend you know Hansel Gretel and the other this those other characters that I added to the story I will have like created video blogs of her and her friends and you know what teenagers do and always like they shoot on their blogs Usually how they hang out with their friends, they go to the movies, shopping, whatever. I will have add that. So this project, well, I think all projects, all the projects that we work this month will help us reach our professional objectives because I, well, I speak with my, for myself and I hadn't worked, I have zero experience with like cross media, trans media. Well, I knew what cross media was because I'm totally like, on the cross media bandwagon I read books and then it's like a movie or a TV show and I'm like going crazy and <laughs> but I hadn't like heard or seen transmedia before or like how video games also like help you know launch this whole franchise or arcs I'm still afraid of arcs but they sound amazing <laughs> And well, the first week, storytelling, my favorite. I love writing. So that was like a practice since the last past month. 
we haven't written that much so that was good and I feel like well with every class I ended up like end up the month and I'm like oh I could totally see myself working on this and again it happens like I can totally see myself in like maybe some storytelling teller singing <laughs> and also transmedia like I love transmedia now I mean I'm still like I need to put it on into practice like how to leave little clues so people can like go to the next platform and connect the story but I love transmedia now I'm gonna be like oh look that show is using transmedia because they're using this and that and that and stuff and yeah I love this class it was awesome